Hello everyone, my name is Taylor Myers and I'm here with MF Fire and today I'm going to talk to you about our Nova Series wood stoves and in particular how to use the bypass, the catalyst bypass in the Nova Series wood stoves which is this handle located over here on the side of the stove. So the first thing that you need to understand is that all of our Nova Series wood stoves and that's Nova, Nova 2, the inserts and the tower models are all equipped with a catalytic combustor. This is a catalytic combustor right here. They sit inside the stove up near the top underneath this top plate here and they serve a very important purpose in the stove. So as smoke passes through this fine honeycomb of the catalytic combustor, impurities are burned off. Carbon monoxide and particulate matter or soot are all burned off by this catalytic combustor. Um, and it helps to clean up the exhaust that goes up the stack or the chimney of your wood stove. But the stove needs to be hot in order for air to be properly drawn through that catalytic combustor. And until it's hot, that smoke will resist going through the fine honeycomb. So you need a way to bypass this catalytic combustor in order for the stove to get hot um, before you can engage the catalytic combustor and take full advantage of it. So, Novas are equipped with a bypass plate. It's a plate that sits near the back of the wood stove, and when the bypass is closed, smoke goes up through the front of the wood stove, through that catalytic combustor, and then out the exhaust. But when the bypass is swung into the open position, the smoke can go directly into the exhaust, which allows the fire to really establish itself before we engage that catalytic combustor. So the bypass plate is controlled by this handle here on the side. On all of the Nova series stoves, Back means that the catalyst is engaged or the bypass is closed. Uh, on Nova, if we want to open that bypass, we swing this handle up forward and to the front. On Nova 2, it swings down and underneath to the front to open it up. And on the insert models, it's a push-pull handle where you push it in to engage or you pull it open in order to open that bypass. So we'll really want to use this bypass handle in two situations. So the first situation is when we are first starting the wood stove. So like I said, we need to get the stove hot. And so you'll swing the bypass forward into the open position. You'll open the door. You'll load the wood and light a fire. You can make a top-down fire. And we have a nice video talking about how to make a top-down fire. Um, and then you'll want to close the door until it's open just a crack, about an inch or two, and leave the bypass open as this fire grows and builds so the stove can really heat up. And uh, you can watch the stove heat up, you can watch the fire develop in there, and all of our stoves are equipped with a catalyst thermometer which sits here on the top of the stove. And when that catalyst thermometer says engage catalyst, then it is time to shut the door and to close the catalyst bypass and then just enjoy the fire. The second time that you'll wanna use that bypass handle is any time that you're gonna go open the door of the wood stove. So that honeycomb resists the flow of air through the catalyst. Um, and if you open the door with the catalyst engaged, you can get smoke out into your room. You don't want smoke in your room. So anytime before you're gonna go open the door, you just swing that bypass handle into the forward position uh, and then open the door just a crack, give it just a few seconds for the air to equalize. And then you can open the door all the way. You can load wood, you can adjust your coal bed, do whatever you need, close the door, close the bypass again. So that's how you use the bypass handle in the Nova series wood stoves. Uh, thank you all so much and stay warm.